So hello beautiful beloved, today I want to do a personal share and it's I'm coming from a vulnerable space. And the, I had this self-talk yesterday when I was giving a session with my clients. Ooh, my offering isn't enough. But when I ask myself, is that an absolute truth? It's not because my client did have some, in, like had good insights and yeah, went through a journey as well. And I feel that she really got the medicine she needed at that time. Yet, I did have some luring thoughts like my offering is not enough. Mm. Or like, I feel it's not as powerful as it can be. So I have such thoughts like this. So when I went deeper, like what's underneath that mental space? So, you know, always go into your emotional body, people. When you're having this mental space, always ask yourself, so how you're feeling? How are you feeling? And how I was feeling is I was feeling sadness. I was feeling sadness because I'm not someone who I want to be yet. You know, I'm not somebody with hardcore psychic ability or I'm not somebody who can change <laughs> cellular level. Hmm. Yeah, and but again, today when I went to the park to meditate on this, I realized this sadness actually was coming from um, this griefing. And when I felt into this energy of grief, it was more like I used to have that power. I used to have that power, but now I don't have it. If only I had that power again. Like if I only can just like access into that power again, I can really support and assist this person even more powerfully, but I don't have that power anymore. So it was more like a grieving. So I thought that was very interesting. Hmm. But also when I meditated on this, you know, this feeling of I'm not, my offering isn't enough, it's, you know, who am I to say that? Because the moments I say that, it's like, who am I to say all oh, my past experience of developing my skills is futile, like I'm denying that. That's a huge disrespect for myself. Also, I'm also feeling, I felt like, who am I to say this and how am I to disrespect my ancestors and my lineage? Because whenever I give offering, I call them in to support me in assist assisting them and to support them for their transformation and for their journey. And if I am to say my offering is not as powerful as it can be, how disrespectful for how disrespectful is that to my ancestors and to my lineage who are helping me and who are bringing me this wisdom through me? Because I truly believe we are all portals, yeah? We're all gateway for all this wisdom to come through us. And when I say that my offering is not as powerful, I'm denying their power. And that really, like, that really sinks in in me. So I know, you know, some of the people who are listening to this, I know that you are someone who are assisting people and supporting people. And know that whatever you are giving and giving to the people, it's already so enough. And you are already receiving so much guidance and so much wisdom from the unseen world. So always trust this and always believe in and yeah, always believe it. And there's no need for you to harm yourself or to be abusive to yourself by having such self-talk. 
And although I do say this, you know, it's not like I'm saying to deny those self-talk. It's okay to feel this self-talk because by having this self-talk, you will be deepening your journey. You will be deepening in your development and your skills. You will be going, learning, you will be going to schools and learning so many beautiful things, which will be a key to unlock your wisdom that you already had before, that you already developed in so many past lifetimes. Mm. So just know that if you do have this self-talk, it's okay and really feel it, feel the sadness or feel the anger, feel the irritation, feel it fully. And know that it's okay to feel this, but it is not okay for you to dwell on it. Mm. And to move on forward. Yep. So today I just wanted to share you what was alive with me yesterday and this morning. And hopefully this also supported you in your in a journey. As it was a beautiful reflection. Like is it, it was a beautiful insight for me. <laughs> yeah, who am I to deny my own inner power? And that goes to you. If you're having self-doubts about your own abilities and about your own knowledge. Yep. So sending you lots of love. I love you so much. Mm.